Okay, we're going to just look at first normal form uh, here. Um, and remember what we're doing for first normal form is that all of the data attributes should be grouped together. So I've grouped them together. So I've got a menu, order data has gone into an order group and the customer data has gone into a customer group. Uh, each entity should have no repeating attributes. Now, um, so I'm looking at the order table at the moment and I can see the company address, company postcode, product description, they could repeat a lot, okay, but they're also existing in the other two tables. So if I know the company name, then I could use this customer table to look up the company address and the postcode. So uh, these are keys here, primary keys. So that's the other thing we have to do. Each record in a table should be uniquely identified. So product code can be uniquely identified. Uh, that uniquely identifies a sandwich and company name uniquely identifies an address. So I don't need those things in here. So I'm just going to um, get rid of those. So I don't need company address and postcode because I can look that up and the description and the cost. I can also look up okay so now the only other thing um, in order total cost total cost can be calculated from the data that's here so we don't want any calculated fields really in here so I'm going to get rid of that as well okay so now I've got company name product code and that could be delivered that could be looked up company name can be looked up from here product code can be looked up from here so the price also the cost will also be looked up so that that negates that um, total cost so we can work that out uh, as we use in the data so okay so the only thing now is to work out what's the primary key for the order table 